how to fix Fortnite crashes in Chapter 5. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to fix Fortnite crashes in Chapter 5. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe for more content. Now, let's jump into the video. First things first, let's clear out all the old Fortnite data from your PC. Press the Windows key and type percentage, temp, percentage, and hit enter. You'll see a bunch of temporary files, including Fortnite stuff. Just press Ctrl A, right click, hit delete, and get rid of all those temporary files. In the next step, let's clean up your Fortnite replays from the previous season. Press Windows key plus R, type percentage, local app data percentage, and click OK. Scroll down to find the Fortnite games folder. Open saved, then crashes, and delete the content in these folders. Now, go back, enter the demo folder, select all files, right-click, and delete them. Lastly, locate the logs folder, select all files, right-click, and delete the Fortnite backups. Click cancel and you're all set. Alright folks, let's get into the next steps. Open up the Epic Games Launcher on your computer and I'll guide you through some crucial settings. Click on the login icon, then head to settings. Now, pay attention to these simple adjustments. Go to desktop modification and uncheck those boxes. Move up to preferences, uncheck run when my computer starts, enable debug logging, and hide game library. Next, scroll down to throttle downloads and uncheck both use proxy and throttle downloads. Now, Go to Fortnite option, click the drop down, and check mark auto update to make sure Fortnite updates itself. Watch out for additional command line arguments, uncheck that box. It's often the culprit for Fortnite crashes. Finally, you can refresh all your Fortnite files by verifying them. Okay guys, next up, open File Explorer and head to where you installed Fortnite. For most people, it's in local disk C. Navigate to Program Files, find the Epic Games folder, go into Fortnite, then Fortnite Games, Binary, Win64. Inside there, locate the BattleEye folder. Open it and you'll see Install BattleEye.bat and Uninstall BattleEye.bat. Double-click Uninstall BattleEye to uninstall it. Then, double-click Install BattleEye to reinstall it and refresh the files. Now, go back to the Fortnite Game folder, go to Saved, then Config and find Crash Report Client. Right click and hit delete. Head back, find the Fortnite executable file, usually named Fortnite Client Win64Shipping.exe. Right click, go to Properties, navigate to Compatibility, and uncheck Disable Full Screen Optimization. Also, uncheck Change High DPI Scaling Behavior. These settings can sometimes cause Fortnite to crash. Click Apply, and you're good to go. Now, launch Fortnite and you should enjoy a smoother experience without crashes or freezes. If you found this helpful, drop a like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more. Peace out!